21, can you do something for me? 21. Can you hit a little rich flex for me? Then 21, can you do something for me? Drop some bars to my pussy ex for me. Then 21, can you do something for me? Can you talk to the ops next for me? Then 21, do your thing. 21, do your thing. We're about to get a second stamp because you're about to belong to the UK. To oh, you already have a UK one? We went to the UK and then... Oh, um, period. Well, okay. Gracias. Ah! I'm official. All right, we just got to Gibraltar. Yeah. Uh, hola. <laughs> hola. Yeah. <laughs> I just got a shake for five pounds. I'm so official. Wait, where's Africa? That's Africa. Gibraltar, we have a quick five minute, ten minute break. It's so beautiful here. We literally saw Africa like the body of the land. Hey, look at the baby over there. You see the baby? Oh my god. So we just got back to the bus. It's been a very long but fun day. So we're headed to Sevilla, which is a popular city in Spain. We just got our rooms and here's a little apartment tour. I said apartment tour. A little room tour. So this is the bathroom. Very pretty. The Andalusian tiles right here. Cute. That was the bathroom. This door does not open, so that's cute. Oh, this door? Yeah. No, I can't open it. But I do have the handle, though. Yeah, it's a mirror right here. And y'all, yeah, it's cute. So, a little chair, a little table here. Here's the view. This is a little Andalusian style print. Y'all look at the bed. It's two beds. Y'all see the distinction? But it's put as one. But it's cute though. I'm back in my room. I actually feel awful. My head has been pounding. I took Tylenol like 30 minutes ago. And then the food was just hurting my stomach. Maybe it was a milkshake I had earlier. I just feel awful. Other people, they're going out tonight, but I don't think the way I feel going out and the festivities aren't gonna help, you know? So I think I'm gonna stay in tonight. It's supposed to have an early morning, but I wanted to show you guys. Look how happy I got over shopping. I wanted to show you guys the things that I bought today. So I bought four things from the first place. So I bought this little mirror. 
Gibraltar is right here at the tip and that's literally the entrance from Europe to Africa right here. This little compact mirror. Look! I need to buy buy gifts. I like buying gifts in something that I will use constantly but also something that I can always see to remember, you know? Anytime I will see this mirror to use it, which will be often, I will always remember Spain and come in here. And then if anyone asks what does this mean, it's also a fun story time. Like, ah! I'm actually gonna put this little compact mirror in my little to-go bag. But I also bought this little patch. It says Gibraltar or Hirata as the Spanish pronounce it because the G is pronounced as the H. Y'all, I am still pronouncing the English way with a Spanish accent. To pronounce it in English, it's Gibraltar. Gibraltar. So I have this one friend in my class where she goes to different countries and she has different patches that she puts on her backpack i don't know how she sews it because that's a whole nother thing patches from like greece from different places i'm like i want to start doing that hello if you're watching this shout out to you i also got these two y'all see it? ah these two bracelets i've always loved bracelets like this and i've always wanted it you guys know me the blue is my favorite color and white always matches with everything so This is actually my first ever souvenir souvenir that I've gotten in Spain, so I love that. These two were five pounds each, 10 pounds. This, as well as the mirror, was eight pounds. But guess who has another visa? This is the UK, because Gibraltar belongs to the UK. So I think I'm gonna turn in and just unpack a bit. Tomorrow, we'll actually get to explore Sevilla. On Sunday, we're gonna go to Cordoba before we head back to Granada. Today we're actually gonna visit Sevilla. Woo 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 woo! I don't have time to do my uh, like lashes of in the full face. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wear. Yeah. If I wear this my sunglasses, you can't even tell that I don't have lashes on. It's a look. It's a vibe. Sevilla is a very very big city in Andalusia, which is the southern part of Spain. I'm really excited. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Oh, let me show y'all my fit. Let me turn on the light. Where's the light? Oh, oh, why right. I forgot about the thing. Spain has this thing called piensa and verde, which means the thing green. So they're very smart with the, how they use the water and electricity and stuff. So that being said, right here, you just put it in and that turns on the lights. But if you take it out, I think it can be any kind of card. This is the fit. The sunglasses. I literally bought these two things literally two days ago just for this trip. So this is a bodysuit. The material is really, really nice. I have this P necklace. It's simple but so cute. And of course, my Gucci sunglasses right there. Studs. These, y'all see this? I'm so excited to finally wear it out. And then these pants, they are definitely a size too big. I wanted that to be loose, but not like this loose. So I bought this belt as well with it. This, this, and this was from Lefties, which is like a cheaper version of Zara that they have here in Spain. But of course, my dunks, they're a bit beat up from Spain. But yeah, this is cute. It's a vibe. This is going to be a fire day. I'm really self-conscious because it's so big. Like, it's literally so big. That's the fit for the day. We got to go. All right, guys, so we're in Sevilla and we're about to get a tour around the entire place. So we are in Plaza de España. And this is the beautiful artwork aquí. We just took a picture because this one says Granada, there's other places. And actually right behind me, right over there, they actually filmed a really popular Star Wars movie. I think it was Return of the Clone or something. But it's so cute and seeing the history, it's a lot. For tourists here in Spain, we have this little thing here and this so no matter how far he is, well still close by, he can be far and I can still hear him. <laughs>
So we just got out of the, the Alcazar Palace and we're about to go to the cathedral, I believe. We're entering the Jewish quarter. Look at this thing glass. And there's so many all around. There's one over there. There's some more over there. Those up there are all stained. So we're walking up ramps, not stairs, to get to the tower, the Hiralga Tower. Number five, there are 30 plants. We're almost there. Ten more. Ooh, eight more. <sighs> we are up in the tower. It is packed. So beautiful, too. So we finished walking up the Geralda Tower. Part of us. And now we're about to go eat some food. It's Mexican food. <laughs> With some spice. God, thank you. Are we here? Oh. So we finished our lunch and we're about to go to this tourist shop. They have this really cute bags that I want. Oh, is this the material strong like that, right? Yeah. Look at these bags, are so cute. They're, they're cute. So we literally just got back. It's a very, very long day. I took some really bomb pictures. I hope to post some of them today and then sprinkle some out for the next few weeks, few months, who knows. So right now it is 4.40 and we have dinner, which is free, including the program, at 8.30 here in the hotel. The plan is this one site in Sevilla. We want to visit that, but I think we want to visit that after dinner because it lights up in the dark. But look. Bags like this are all the rage here in Europe. It says Sevilla, so this is like my little trinket from Sevilla. My friend Samaya that's studying abroad in France has a bag just like this. And a lot of people here also have bags like this. So it's really cute. And it goes with my outfit. It goes with everything. Like, it's a vibe. But yeah, that's what I bought today. Nothing too crazy. So I have a couple hours for a siesta, which you guys know is a Spanish nap after lunch. Yeah, yeah. So talk to you guys later. So it's 10 p.m. and we're going to see the mushroom, which is like this big, how do I describe it? This big monument. <laughs> this is the gang for now. Oh, this is my cute little bag. Of course, I had to bring it with me. Alright guys, so we're still walking the street. We are walking. We, are, we love Sevilla. It's really, really cute. Um, we were starting some dancing. Salsa? What? Yeah, he was singing really good. He was singing to someone. Is it us? Hey. Maybe. <laughs> oh! 
That's scary. Oh, that scared me. Oh, look at that. That's scary. I thought it was a real person. It's just a statue. Something. <laughs> Anyways, it was a 15 minute walk from the metro to where we're going, the mushroom thing. But as you can see, it's an hour later and we still have not gotten to our location. But we had a really good reason. We were stopping for like, oh, this is really cute. Smelling the roses. Yeah, smelling the Oh, this is really cute. Or we got some ice cream, stopped for like 10 minutes. The little dancing. Like, we had good reason to. La Abuela here again? Wow. But we are one minute away, so I can't wait for the view. Yo, look at the view. Look at the mushroom. So y'all, this is how it's gonna be like to be on the mushroom. And we're waiting in line for it. So let's go. Yo, look at the view. All right guys, this is day three. We are headed to Cordoba and then from there go back to Granada. Let me show you guys the fit for the day. Just a cute little black number with my dunks once again. I'm not too crazy, I'm about to hop in the bathroom to pee. We're already packed and ready to go. Yo, we are in Cordoba. It's actually a really beautiful city. Gia literally forgot her phone, but yes, I can't wait to show you guys all around. The nap was beautiful, by the way, y'all. We have like 45 minutes before the tour starts, so we're just looking around the tiendas, the different shops, to really shop around. Let's go. Yo, I think I'm gonna get this for my host mom because that's her name. Isn't it cute? ¿Qué es más famosa? Pinchitos, morunos de pollo o kebab de pollo, salsa y yogurt? Pinchitos que no ves más. Oh. Kebab de pollo. All right, y'all. So we just started the tour.
tourists going on. This place is so beautiful. Every single thing. And it's also divided in like different time periods. So the 5th century, the 10th century, things like that. It's really beautiful. And every single pillar is different. This one is different from this one over there. Like every single one. I think I... Let me walk up to the rest of the group. It's been an hour and a half long. I think we still have 25 minutes left.